Dairy farmers in Georgia are going back to the basics. Conventional methods keep cows locked inside barn stalls, but the growing trend sends them out to the pastures. Claude Gibbons, an Athens area dairy farmer, explains how the grazing dairy industry could be more profitable. I think it would be cheaper to feed them in the pasture because of not the feed has got expensive to buy, so you know, it's cheaper I'm sure to keep them in the pasture. Local farmers seem to be following the trend as 8,000 cows are expected to be grazing Georgia fields by 2010. The cows are enjoying the hay today here in Monroe, Georgia, where they are running free. And that seems to be the trend these days. But for some farmers, they like to keep their cows in the barn, which can be a little bit expensive than this. Some dairy farmers disagree. Co-owner of a Wilkes County dairy farm, Stephen Smith, says his cows are happier in the barn. Everything they need in that barn right there is they, they lay in a, a sand bed that speaks for them twice a week. They're comfortable. They, all they got to get up and walk 20, 30 feet and eat and go lay back down. They're stressed a lot less, so they give them more milk. When they're, the less stressed the cow is, the better the milk gum. So. <laughs> Both farmers agree it takes one full acre to feed one cow. Researchers say that Georgia is perfect for year-round grazing with all of its open land. The opportunity is there, the trend is up, and dairy farmers are on board. Now it's up to the cows, the milk, and the consumers. From the Grady College, I'm Thomas Wilson, WNEG, Northeast Georgia.